Let's go, princess! Welcome to another edition of Reckless Eating Shorts, aka We Shorts, Matt Zion along with Chuck Roland. You can follow me at Matt Zion We on Twitter and Instagram. You can follow me at Chuck underscore Roland on Twitter. And, and if you're a chick, he'll follow you. Yes. <laughs> Same on Instagram. At Chuck Roland We. <laughs> I've noticed Or if that. you're a dude, I know. If you go through if you go through all of his followers, every one of them is a woman. <laughs> he wants to get <laughs> All of them live like so far, like New York I know. and Texas. Yeah, isn't that a problem? And, oh when, my god. Before I met Lori when I was single, there was like that's one of the I was like Ohio, another one. I was like, we didn't have a much smaller fan base too back then. But I was like, maybe I can just find like a good girlfriend through that, which actually I did, because Lori was a fan of the show and that's how I met her. But uh, I was like, maybe I can find someone. Everybody lives like in Alaska. <laughs> like, yeah. oh, fly out to meet me in Alaska, eh? Even though they're not Canadian, I don't know. Yeah. So I have a new product. But it's, it's neighboring to Canada. <laughs> <laughs> a new product from Kraft. This is Kraft Hot Habanero String Cheese. Huh. Yeah, right? That doesn't seem like something they would get into. Yeah. A weird product for Kraft to indulge itself upon. But I'm down, bro. I'm down. I'm Obviously, down clown. the bag's open, so I've already been eating these. <laughs> I will save my uh, my complaint and likes for them after we've already had it. Uh, Kraft string cheese is really good, though. Like, Ray was Kraft yeah. string cheese. I know Chris, like, hates Kraft. He calls it crap. Oh. I like Kraft. Kraft yeah. is good. Like, Kraft, he hates Kraft mayo, but, like, I think it's fine. It's all right. Yeah, yeah it's whatever. It's just, yeah. you know. But there's bits of the habanero peppers mixed into this cheese. I can oh, see you're that. actually gonna string cheese it. I will I just, string cheese it. I never string cheese string cheese. I just do this, bro. I usually do that too, but I'm gonna go old school and string cheese it. The first time I tried this was in a Walmart parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> I bought, I bought the bag. I was super hungry, and I'm like, I'll have one. No big deal. Yeah. I didn't like it that much. Then I was in the house, and I was too lazy to go get food. And I'm like, I'll have another one. <laughs> It's odd. Wow. It does have the flavor of a habanero, but it does indeed lack the heat of a habanero. Yeah. Which I think is a plus in this type of product. You do not want yeah, to be no, like- you don't want, <laughs> you don't eat cheese and be like dying because your mouth is on yeah. fire. So it's a, it's a general product. Like the only thing reason you can find this is for the flavor. And it does definitely taste like a habanero. Yeah, for, for the product, it is a perfect amount of spice with the habanero. It's good. It's not amazing, but it's definitely a uh, a hunger quencher. Something <laughs> you can throw that away. I it's will finish this. this. <laughs> it's decent enough. Yeah. My main complaint is after I eat it, maybe like five ten minutes later, I kind of get a stomach ache going on. I feel like the mm. pieces of habanero may not be that hot, but it's still kind of an issue with your stomach. Oh, I guess the uh, issue with the acids I just, and whatnot. Yeah, I just kind of have like a little rumbling, and I just, I'm like, uh, I'm uncomfortable. It only lasts five minutes or so, but it's enough to where I notice it. Mm -hmm. Taste wise, though, it's good. It's regular, better than regular string cheese. Like, it's got an extra little kick. Yeah, yeah. I would, I would give it a four. I love cheese. I love the spice. It's perfect amount. Yeah, regular. I, you know, like I said, it's better than regular string cheese. I would also give it a four. It's a good price. And it's totally a gimmick. Like this will not be around for a very long time. But I'm waiting for, like, the ghost pepper craft string cheese or something, <laughs> or like the cho chocolate bootla, and we'll actually <laughs> swallow that one. But yeah, there you go. They have them at Walmart. I actually got this at the Walmart grocery store, which is the best name ever because they're shutting down all the local mom and pop grocery stores and just making themselves the grocery store. Yeah. <laughs> Walmart. <laughs> but there you go. What are your thoughts on this? Have you had it before? And if not, are you interested to try it? Let us know in the comments down below. And thank you for joining us for this edition of Wee Shorts. We'll see you on the next one.